There's a lot of anecdotal advice around on improving your marriage, but if you want something you can really use that will actually make a difference and reignite your marriage, check out the link in the description below. The question, what's the most depressing aspect of marriage? As sure as change does not equal progress, marriage does not necessarily equal better life. However, if you go into this marriage thing knowing about the challenge ahead, you can have a much better life than before. What sport coaches figured in that most people haven't. You don't pick up a loser and make him slash her a player of the team. I mean, some couples spend years together in misery. Why? It just takes half a second to look at him slash her and understand why. Some people just don't have the right ingredients, it's that simple. Some people are not built for this long-term relationship thing. It's not bad. It becomes bad when two persons with two different sets of goals date each other with absolutely no desire to find out about the other person. Even worse, they find out about their partner and they set out to change him slash her. Worst idea ever. You don't pick up a loser and make him slash her a team player. Is S slash he in this thing for the long haul? If it's been several weeks and S slash he didn't ask anything about your childhood or your friends or your family, that's not a good sign. Did S slash he ask to meet your children if you already have kids? Did S slash he ask to meet your friends and family? Did S slash he ever gave you a sign that S slash he is planning his slash her life for more than two weeks ahead? Or what happens after wedding day? Okay, assuming you challenged yourself and your partner and you know that S slash he has the right ingredients to make your married life great. What happens now? It's like you made it to the NBA and now you can rest. Oh wait. That's not it at all. Once you're in, the staying in starts. Members of the team have to train every single day in order to stay in. Mentally and physically. What most of us do once we get married. Yep, we rest. Winning day was a lot of fun and now we can settle because our partner is granted. I would argue that today, it is probably easier to get in the NBA than to stay married for more than one decade, assuming you have the right ingredients from the start of course. What is everyday workout looking like in a healthy marriage? You acknowledge your fortune every single morning. You understand that some behavior are more risky than others, and keep away from them. You decided a common path together and stick to it. Family, religion, money whatever you know you can bring up challenging topics without fearing separation overall you trust your partner to take his slash her decisions with your family's best interest in mind surely this kind of marriage leads to a better life i can tell you after 19 years together that it does i'm positive i'm currently writing my next book about romantic relationships it would mean the world to me if you take a few minutes for this survey what relationship advice do you want to read about everyone has had rocky patches the difference between it being a patch and a drop of a cliff is what you do now. Check the link in the description if you want a helping hand.